It's another sunny, fun day with Carol and Debbie. Once again, Siesta Beach ranks number one in the U.S. It's beautiful. And 11th in the world. That's magnificent. It really is. So, you know, with that ranking, it keeps our restaurants, beaches, hotels, you know, in that top ranking category uh, that is amongst the U.S. and according to TripAdvisor. Mm -hmm. So I guess with Siesta Key uh, Beach, um, this was a platform used by Traveler's Choice. And people also collected, uh, this This information was collected pre-COVID uh, pandemic, mm -hmm. but it, it honors over 4,800 businesses out of 8.7 million. It's a lot. That, that was surveyed. Wow. Okay. Uh, and besides our number one beach, uh, real estate, you know, that's been a season like mm -hmm. no other. Mm -hmm. uh, while we have that number one beach, things in our market that are attracting buyers to our area is also the culture. Sure. Our, our arts. So uh, while September typically is a month for planning uh, for us, um, it's been a, a very different season. We have rolled from no winter season right into summer, and summer we're going to roll right back um, into the next season. So we've kind of adopted that showbiz man mantra of the show must go on. Sure. So one thing is clear, the industry uh, in this industry, we listen to our clients and we're always there to help them get to that next mm -hmm. chapter. And, you know, so recessions, depressions, and pandemic, it does not slow us down. Our season has been upside down. Sure. But uh, it, the show must go on. And we're fielding calls every day from all over the United States. That's right. And um, one thing I heard in the news the other day that I made a note. Um, oh, in New York. So yeah. we keep saying New York, New Jersey, Chicago, now California, those states where they have the highest taxes. And in New York, they said New Yorkers, 44% have been thinking about leaving their state and one out of eight are I know. leaving their state. They're even looking at statewide of having a bailout tax close to 10% yeah. for, for what's been going on with the pandemic. Yes. They've suffered. They really have. Mm -hmm. um, what's going on with real estate well, there? <laughs> speaking of moving to our beautiful sunny Florida and this area in particular, Manatee and Sarasota County, Rosedale, uh, truly, um, you know, we know that our community is amazing. Our fees are minimal mm -hmm. with the amenities that are just top of the line in in our opinion. Great people, great amenities, great staff. Um, so with that being said, we have a low, low inventory. Um, 18 active, Carol, today, as of this morning. That's oh, the wonderful. lowest I've seen in 20 years. We have 29 homes pending. And the past 180 days, we have actually sold 75 homes in Rosedale. Can you believe that? Um, so our average uh, price sold per square foot with pools and without pools encompassed together is $191.14 um, price per square foot. And that has come up because yep. that activity, but yes. again, you got to remember that activity uh, depicts things that went sold or were pending yes. almost two months ago. Absolutely. So it has been climbing. And that's a positive reflection of the value of our homes here in Rosedale. So anyway, um, do we want to leave with any some news about... Well, we've got uh, one other thing I did want to talk about. Oh, mm -hmm. construction. Is, is construction. So that construction, uh, that 44th Street connection that's at the back of we've the been, We've been watching it for quite some time. We have been watching it. And it's, it's back on. Mm -hmm. So construction workers are, again, working on that extension um, that's going to take it from 44th Street over the Braden River uh, Bridge and then over 75. Mm -hmm. So, and I think they said it's going to be in 2023 that project will be completed. 
Um, but it's it's going to be straight bring, shot to the beach. Straight shot to the beach. It's going to relieve some of that activity as far as traffic on 64 and 70. Yes. And we're going to have even more connectivity coming right out our back gate. And so going, east west. East west. West east. Okay. So again. Yeah, that's more, the update. More convenience to mm -hmm. our little slice of heaven called Rosedale. And until then, see you later, alligators. After a while, crocodiles. <laughs>